Chu, and I'm the founder and CEO of SokaWatch. SokaWatch is a last mile ordering and delivering service for small African retail shops. Um, so basically, if you run a small retail shop right now, here in East Africa known as the Dukas, uh, you're responsible for sourcing your own inventory, typically two to three times a week, which requires you to physically leave your shop, run all over town to different wholesale points, buy a product, and then bring it back. Uh, this, of course, is a big waste of time, as well as a big added cost for these small business owners. Um, and the result of this process is actually limited product availability. So customers coming into your shop after you've sold out of it and not being able to buy it. Um, and this is a problem not just for you and your customers, but also for the huge multinational companies that manufacture these goods. Uh, companies like Unilever, Procter & Gamble, you name it. And so what we do is we provide a service that gets them the product, the stock that they need whenever they want it. So basically, if you're a shopkeeper, all you need to do is send a text message to a toll-free number any time of the day. We will guarantee delivery of products to you, anything from chewing gum to condoms, within 24 hours, free of charge. And the reason we can do that is because we partner directly with the manufacturers of these products. We charge them a commission on all the products that are ordered and sold through the network. So right now, uh, we work with companies including Unilever, GlaxoSmithKline, Wrigley, uh, PSI, and now Chandaria. Um, we service about 5,000 shops across Nairobi. Uh, last month did about $60,000 worth of sales. Um, and actually also just launched last month in uh, Dar es Salaam as well. Obviously, if you look at the opportunity here, um, there are about 10 million shops, uh, these small retail shops across Southern Africa. Average shops spend about $200 a week on inventory. Uh, so of course, this is the base of the pyramid, the average uh, place where everybody gets their consumer goods. Um, even if you look at Kenya, 98% of people, you know, regardless of your social class, are actually getting products from these shops on a weekly basis. Um, so this is really the heart of the African retail market. And certainly if you look at any of these multinational companies, they see it that way there too, in terms of their engine of growth moving forward. Um, so right now, uh, we're raising a million dollars. Um, the goal over the next year is to expand to the key urban uh, markets in East Africa uh, that we're not already in. So we're currently in Nairobi, Dar es Salaam. Uh, we're planning to expand to Mombasa, Kampala, and Kigali as well. Um, so yeah, uh, if you're interested in learning more, uh, please feel free to come up to me afterwards and uh, look forward to talking further. Thank you.